So card carrying skank, Sukihana has an emotional breakdown of some sort that I can't play you for copyright reasons, but the gist of the reason as to why she was crying is because she got tired of being judged by her past. Somebody in an interview brought up some things from her past and it, it broke her. It, it, and I'm very confused by that. She went in the bathroom and cried and was yelling and, you know, look it up online. I can't play it, but this is my general reaction to Sukihana crying about being judged by her past. <laughs> Suki Hana said, don't judge me by my past. Your past was five minutes ago. That's like somebody taking it right out their mouth and just, um, um, don't, don't judge me by what I've done in the past uh, five seconds ago. I, I'm a changed person now. I w will not be judged by what I just did uh, 10 seconds ago. Now, what, what was the straw that broke the 304's back? I, I am curious. What, what was it? Let's see. Apparently, apparently somebody brought up this in the video when her and Unsexy Red was dog walked in a rap video. They were walked like some dogs. And I guess that was the thing that that made it a big deal that, that she just broke down and don't be bringing up my past. Everybody, you know, came for her. that was a new low. And and I'm like, um, OK, I looked it up and uh, it looks pretty par for the cause to me. I mean, that's that's typically what she do that's what they do like how is this the the thing that just that just made her have a breakdown don't bring up my past as if she hasn't done worse than this since then like this was not that's normal skank behavior i mean like he's hold he's holding her hair it's like what's, <laughs> that's what her and uh unsexy red do but on a, on another note always you know never never forget this Sexy Red looks like conservative YouTuber Anthony Brian Logan. Just, you know, come get your daughter. I know she's strayed away from your from your principles and values, but never too late for her to come home. Go go get your daughter. She out there wilding. But nevertheless, nevertheless, I don't know how that gave Sukihana a breakdown. Her bringing up her past. And, you know, like, how is that any worse than what she did, like, right here like this was just a few weeks ago if i remember correctly when she went to the mtv awards and that's how she hit the hit the carpet like 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 so like how is that the moment that she has a full emotional breakdown and and don't bring that up like like somebody explain that to me <laughs> how was any of that any different i want to know and even just this wasn't even that long ago when she was um when she was out in London. I'm, I'm trying to get my coochie stretched. I'm trying to get my coochie stretched and eat. All right, I had to cut it right there because that was where she said, "Eat a ninja's um rectum rectal area." I see those friendly white folks out there just got done having tea and crumpets with the royal family, and she out there talking about uh getting their coochies stretched in, uh, and cannibalizing butts and all kind of, you know, so <laughs> this was, this was like a, about a, what, a month ago? <laughs> like how, <laughs> how, how does that give her the breakdown? How does she just lose it over that? Like what else is out here? Like I just went and randomly said, Oh, Oh no. I, I, I wait, hold on. Wait, sorry. Sorry. Damn it. I can't make it leave. Wait. Okay, I may edit that out. I may edit that out of my video. That was that was her sucking some toes. Uh, like those were just like some of just the more easily searchable things, and it was it was it was more. It's a laundry list. Like her her list goes on and on. Like there's no past that you have to hide from when that past is still your present. Like it's no that it's no logical justification for have feeling any type of way about anything that anybody could possibly ask her or could possibly say to her. It's like you, th that would only be the case if, if, okay, I'll, I'll, I'll go here. I'll go here. Somebody told me I need to leave this one alone, but let's just say when Umar, um, went and uh, scooped her up. All right. When Umar went and scooped her up where he gave that, that fake speech where he was talking about how, 
you know, you know, if she's willing to change from her wicked ways and and we put the <laughs> what did he say? And we put consciousness before the coochie and business, the business of pro blackness before the back shots. And she could she could be the conscious queen and use her platform to speak to the masses and change our people. And, and, and you know, they, they still look like they hooked up anyway. I mean, it, 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 neither here nor there. But he, the fact of the matter is, <laughs> if Umar would have succeeded in turning her from her wicked ways, and she was, you know, walking around just, just Betty Shabazzed out, you know, speaking, speaking the good message for the black woman and all of that. But people just wouldn't, you know, she's been doing that for some years and people just won't let her live down her, her, her ratchet past. I would understand. I would understand. But when your ratchet past is literally five minutes ago, you don't get to have a breakdown about somebody bringing up your ratchet past. That's that's your ratchet present. So, that it, it, you know, and I don't even want to get real deep and introspective in this video because this is like some nonsense. But let me get Umar off the screen. <laughs> Sorry, Umar. <laughs> I don't even want to try to get all deep and introspective in this video because I'm, I'm just kind of clowning this. But it's like in a roundabout way, she wasn't crying about her past. She's crying about her present that she's not proud of that's essentially what it is like the whole the you know <laughs> it's not a trope when they say that the 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 um adult uh movie stars you know they cry in the shower after the scene like that that's what we just saw <laughs> that's essentially what we just saw right here you know they go they 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 go on the scene they do all kind of wild out crazy stuff it, you know they put on a good show they put on a good performance the whole works excellent brilliant performance was 100% into it getting in in you know help to you know you look look at the views they got 50 million views on the on the on the little streaming platforms you know she she helped she helped 50 million men get one off that day and she looked proud about it. She looked proud about it. But after that scene, no matter how well she performed, she still got in that shower when 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 washing all the the the, the you know the <laughs> when wa when wa when washing the um the, the the shot the money when 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 washing the money shot out of her hair, <laughs> she's in there crying. <laughs> that's 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 the reality that's the reality even you even your favorite uh, uh starlet yeah she cries in the shower after some of those scenes and i think that's what we just saw suki honda do we just saw her cry in the shower that that was that was it she's still going to go back and do another scene <laughs> and she could probably she might cry in the shower again but that's all that just happened there but all right we got to get up out of here <laughs>